Does beer cereal, beer coffee, or beer milk taste any good? Probably not. So I'm going deep in the ale trenches to answer a question that nobody ever asked. Starting off with the beer. Look, you got like 5,000 different types of beers. You got IPAs, you got lagers, you got sours, you got disgusting light beers. But for this experiment, if I can even call it an experiment, because I'm not doing any science. Beer! This beer in question is from my favorite local brewery. It's Rebellion Brewery Beer. I've had it before. It's literally one of my favorites. Heading into the cereal, we also have Cinnamon Toast Crunch, which is my favorite cereal. So going into this beer cereal scenario, I'm giving it the best possible chance here, okay? I bought this bowl today because it's glass and see-through and I wanted to give you the best experience possible. I hope you enjoy the lengths I'm willing to go. Do you put the beer before the cereal or the cereal before the beer? That's the question. Oh God, I ripped it down the side. A little raw cereal never hurt anybody. This looks like the world's greatest ad about to happen. By the way, it's like three o'clock right now. I'm drinking early. Give it a little mix up. I don't know. It's carbs with carbs and sugar and cinnamon. How bad could it be? Before I chomp down, did you know that only 10% of the people that view this channel are subscribers? That's unbelievably low. You should absolutely think about hitting that subscribe button and while you're at it, smash the shit out of that bell until it bleeds. Or else, I'm not, I'm not even a violent person. You could literally punch me in the street and I'd say nothing. I'm gonna edit this part out because I don't want people to come up to me and punch me in the street. I'm thirsty and hungry. Beer cereal coming up. Bon Apple Teeth. It's actually not terrible, which is unbelievable. It, like I know it's weird, but like it's doable. I'm blown away by the fact I can I can eat this without feeling gross, you know? If I had like an oatmeal stout, this would be a godsend. Like a thick beer, like a Guinness. Fuck it, I'm gonna eat the whole bowl. Hold on, I'm gonna sip the drink. Oh, it's so cinnamony. It's like an eight and a half out of 10 for burial. We got other things, we gotta move on, we gotta move on. I got beer hiccups. So this is my favorite coffee. It's, uh, <laughs> I don't even know the fucking name of it. <laughs> All right, it's a good coffee. It's not my, f I don't know if it is my favorite. If I don't know the name of it, is it my favorite? Probably not. It's a stand up cup of joe. Huh? A little, little, little cold brewskis. Making some cold brewskis today. Now, I'm not a bitch, so I'm gonna pour this in, uh, freehand it. Okay. If there's one thing I know, coffee is absolutely the destroyer of taste buds. It's like a neutralizer. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, the coffee dust. <coughs> the coffee's a big neutralizer of smell and taste. So I don't know what's gonna overtake. I, it's probably gonna overtake the beer flavor, so it could work out. It's a Kolsch style beer. I didn't read the label, but it's, it's Kolsch. That's another one of the 5,000 types of beers. I'm gonna pour this in nice. Wow, that looks like a cappuccino. Does this not look like the world's creamiest? I don't like that word. I don't like the word creamy. But it looks like a creamy cappuccino with only froth in it. If you want to be like a breakfast drinker, this is like the most amazing video you've ever seen. If this is good, if this is good, I don't know. It looks like it's mixing. This looks like a cappuccino. I can't get over that. I don't know what's happening. I'm assuming things will be fine. I'm assuming it'll be good. I'm assuming at the end of this, I'm just gonna enjoy a cup of joe made out of beer. Diboja. Oh, oh, that's dauntingly disgusting. That has so much potential to be better. Hold on though. 
No, it's not good. I may have put in a little bit too much coffee. If you like black coffee, this might actually be a smash hit. But for right now, it's a not very good. Cold Brewski gets like a three out of 10. This is still a valid option for breakfast. Bilk. What would make this breakfast complete other than like a glass of bilk? This expires really soon and I just, I really want to take a snifter first. Oh, it smells like milk. This is working. There's acidity in beer, right? This has to curdle. Has to curdle. There's no way it doesn't curdle. I may have put too much milk in. Hold on, we're gonna do a redo. A true professional has more than one cup. Winners, your cups suck. No, I'm not using this cup. I'm a prima donna. I want good cups. This'll do. This. Now we'll add the sexy little bit of milk. Absolutely identical. Share it with a friend. Invite them over. I just realized I haven't washed these cups. I think I'm gonna go with this one first. Maybe I'll, they're gonna be the exact, what am I saying? Diboja. <laughs> Absolutely not. It tastes like spoiled milk. I'm not even going in for a second taste. I'll go on this one. I don't know, it's not gonna be different. I know it's not. Oh my god, it just tastes like glue! I feel like there's dust and hair on the inside of these glasses that have accumulated over the two months I've owned these cups and never used them. What do I rate it? One out of 10. It has flavor, it's just not flavor full. Flavor bad! Hold on, I need a palate cleanser. Oh, that's a good beer. Oh, what the fuck? It looks like little mountains. Yeah, it's not. That's bad. All right, we ruined an already terrible thing. If you're an alcoholic, I'm so grateful that you tuned in. Well, if you're wondering what to have for breakfast, definitely this, maybe that, but don't do this or you might want to hurt people in your family circle, like your loved ones or your friends. I know I would. That's why I'm staying in my basement, so I harm no one. Hey, if you wanna watch some other cool videos, YouTube picked one specifically for you right up there. I picked this one. Let me know which one's better. However, you should hit that subscribe button. Make sure you absolutely hit the bell. If you don't hit the bell, mm, I'm mad. And make sure that you have breakfast with your family and call your mom once in a while. I'm gonna call my mom after this. Beer cereal.